UN General Assembly launches its 19th session with the Soviet Union creating headlines, while three new members are admitted, bringing the total of national flags to 115. The Soviet make news in New York because of its lack of payments on some 52 millions overdue in peacekeeping assessments. Even as the delegates arrived, there were dramatic down-to-the-deadline negotiations to head off a U.S.-Soviet collision. Russia could lose its assembly vote. But at the last moment, representatives of the four big powers meeting in Secretary General Uthan's office agreed on a formula. In the opening weeks of the assembly, voting will be bypassed while an effort is made to solve the financial issue. And so to the first business and the election by acclamation of Ghana's chief delegate, 40-year-old Alex Quezon Saki as president of the General Assembly. He appears in tribal garb, apparently as a concession to the occasion, and as the first representative from the Africa of his race to preside over the world conclave, he tells the delegates... By your unanimous decision, you have today bestowed on me an honor which goes far beyond my humble person. For this is a tribute to Africa, and to Ghana in particular and above all, to millions of people of African descent everywhere.